I just wanted to talk about um, a few things that I am grateful for. One of the things that I'm grateful for is, as always, being alive. We tend to underestimate how um, important it is to be grateful that we are alive. A lot of people didn't make it through the week, through last week, throughout the year, the new year. So it's one of the things I just wanted to say is that I'm grateful to be alive. Um, another thing I'm good for is my health. Um, you know, I can wake up in the morning feeling energized. I can eat breakfast and you know, sit down and do my work. These are basic things that we sort of take for granted and we don't know how much that uh, our health can be impacted by uh, these things. Um, another thing I'm grateful for is my family. Um, that they're well, that they're okay, and they're not uh, suffering from any illness or any pain, which is always great to see. Um, of course, I'm grateful for my father, um, my mother, and my brother too. Um, another thing I'm grateful for is having the ability to focus. Um, previously, sort of a couple months back or a few years back, uh, I used to lack focus. And it's something that I've been steadily improving on and has been naturally coming to me over the past few years. Um, so yeah, uh, another thing I'd say I'm grateful for is the ability to the ability to sort of do the basic things of life like just eating, drinking, walking, you know, listening to music, all of these things that again we all we all take for granted. You know, a lot of people have uh, had an illness where they've lost their ability to see, for example, or their ability to speak, um, which is unfortunate. I'm just grateful that I'm able to do these things on a regular basis and not you know, be affected by these things, which is always great. Uh, yeah, that's all. Fuck your mouth and let me hear you say thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hello, good morning. Happy Easter to everyone. My name is Collins. I'm here to talk about what I'm grateful for this Easter Sunday. Well, given that it's Easter Sunday, first day, the resurrection of Jesus Christ. You know, so uh, 1 Corinthians 15 talks about how if Christ invites from the dead, we are still in our sins and we are the most miserable people because people debated a lot about, um, you know, whether or not Jesus rose from the dead, there were a lot of teachings back then that it wasn't the real thing, but every other thing happened, he did die and all that. And, you know, it's very important because his resurrection is proof of who he is, that he said it in my fulfillment of prophecy. He said, um, destroy this temple, referring to himself. I will just destroy this temple and bring it up in three days and stuff like that, and, you know. So it's very important because if, if he wasn't divine or God, then he would not have been able to atone for the sins in the first place and if you can't kill the spirit. So basically, it's important that uh, that, that happened. So, you know, and because and, without that, there's no salvation and salvation is many, it's, it's many it has many wells, if I can say. Uh, there's, the, there's the physical of healing, there is the spiritual, the eternal life, and you know, the other things. So yeah, basically salvation. And I'm also grateful for you know this season, yeah, because of school work. Basically, this is my, I'm I'm rounding up my second semester. I have exams coming up soon, and I have a lot of coursework as well coming up. So, so for the progress I've been making in my masters, I'm quite happy with that. So yeah, I'm grateful for that. And I'm also grateful for provision because ever since the whole lockdown, I haven't really lacked anything. Uh, I haven't really had any reason to, you know, think of what I'm going to eat or 
struggle in any real way so i'm grateful for that i'm also grateful for health because i have not been sick in a very 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 long time i don't remember the last time i was sick yeah, so that's one thing i'm thankful for. i'm thankful for direction as well thankful that i have a you know, greater understanding of what i want to do you know after i finish my degree and all that i'm also thankful for growth spiritually thankful for you know, greater knowledge of scripture greater prayer and all that i'm thankful for my family i'm thankful for their life i'm thankful for their help i'm thankful for my sister's progress as well academically you know, she's rounded up with six form so yeah generally i'm grateful for a lot of things so that's just what i have to say this is Thank you. 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 Thank you.